We have a statue there, you do go ahead. Yeah, I guess that's just because they did the box night in the train, all right. As bad as uh, before or, or less? Yeah, it's a little better. Uh, I'm off spot, but it's a little better. If you leave the north, it's a little bit off. Okay, 32, I read that. Uh, thank you, and dispatch your route. Here's the lineup. Okay, sir. Good guy. Ever? Skinny bitch. Yeah, I know. Uh, lineup number 221, 221. Lineup Wenatchee to Ballard. Westbound number 357, 357 and 0. 64 D West to Drag. By Leavenworth. There is a call. Number 88, James 2534, 2534, 2531, 2531, 423, 423, Conductor Stewart, S-T-U-A-R-T, Engineer Craig, C-R-A-I-G. Clear him up? Right. And a break clear, see next to 2534, 2534 East. Three orders, 225, 717, 718, the message, and scene 861. 861, at OK at 607. We're out there on the main line now, Gil, when you want to give us some switches in the block. Coming right up right now. Okay. So, did you ever find out what they did with those kids? Yeah. Well, they didn't do anything? Yeah. Chased him, huh? I know they said they called the police. Yeah, but I don't know whether they even caught him or not. And they were there today, so I thought I'd better say something to them. Oh, they're going to get it. Yes, they are. Well, I see my caboose coming here. I'll see you then, Gil. Yeah, Number one track and go in the clear at the tank track at Muck on number one track. Okay. Now well, this eighty three thought they had uh, hit somebody down at Buckle Field. Come to find out somebody just uh, made a dummy complete with boots and stuff with rags and everything, put it down between the rails. Bayside Yard. Yeah, can you hear that guy at the mile post, No, I can't. Well, he says he got the wrong car numbers on the pickup. Uh, uh, I don't know what. Well, I tell him to hang on there and I'll, I'll get a hold of that deep one. He must have the bills. Ever? 32. 32 at 404, out uh, 411. Hello, Gil. This is Paul George. Oh, Paul. What are you doing down at the Oh, holy. Oh, uh, we're going to start raising that bridge, Gil. Oh, you are, huh? Yeah, they're going to have uh, the Morris and uh, be working on it uh, starting probably next Tuesday. Of course, i got to raise the track on both ends of it. And we're, we've got a whole lot of bank widening in there. Oh, probably three, four thousand 4,000 yards of bank widening. Dispatcher to the 417 West, over. Yeah, this is uh, Great Northern 417 West, Dispatcher, come in. Dispatcher to cut one unit off at Gold Tower for the time trade east, over. Yeah, Dispatcher, we have had to isolate and kill the 426 because uh, the turbo auxiliary pump light came on and we couldn't get it off, so we've had to isolate and kill that one. The uh, engine air filter light is on on the 418, so actually we've only got one unit. I don't know how we can set one out for them.
Mr. Goldbar. Goldbar. Yeah, uh, say, we'll be ready to leave here probably about 30, 40 minutes now, Gil. We're all done down with that switch on the uh, west end. Okay. And there's going to be uh, 18 empties on the west end of six. Well, we got them all lined up for, and according to that list, we got them in a row. They're all for fish or flower mills, and you want them together so somebody could pick them up and get them into town. Okay, fine. And you're going to have track two, three, four, and seven clear at Gold Bar when we leave here. Six months that you're starting to start to get that thing cleared out. Get in the yard in shape. Dispatcher Goldberg? Yeah. Any chance of 734 to go to Monroe? Yeah, we may as well get rid of you, I guess. Okay, well, we're up to East End and be down going over the West Switch in about three, four minutes. Okay. All right, sir. That's your line change index. Yeah. Yeah, Bob, this is Henry. I'm off in the clear on the set-off. We got the new set-off belt by the telephone. Okay.